Thank you, Mr. President. I ask unanimous consent to introduce my guest and make a comment. Thank you so much. Um, I want to start by saying I remember last year, so all of you can say 13 years and 8 years and whatever, okay, second year. Um, and I want to say last year I remember standing up and feeling so much pride and so scared and so much responsibility. And I thought, this is going to be really hard. And um, my uh, minority floor leader said to me, don't worry. That's how I said, don't worry. We're all family here. It's going to be fine. And then I can remember when it got to this point on the floor last year, um, the Senate Majority Leader said, this is a family. He said, we're going to have a good time. And we're going to do good things for the state. I thought, these two leaders, they are such politicians. But I tell you what, by the end of the session, I realized that we are family. And so I, of course, want to introduce the family that's very close to me. But I want that's to tell family. every single person here, I have so much respect for every single one of you. And I know how hard that we work to get here. And I know uh, I get hate mail. I don't know about you, but I imagine <laughs> that you do. And, um, you know, I have uh, constituents that call me a lot and make demands. And I know that you do, too. And I know how hard it is. And I also know that we're all here for the state of New Mexico. And that regardless of whether or not we believe the same thing philosophically, I know that we're all here to do, do the right thing for the state. And we might have different ways that we think we're going to go about it. But I just want to say I am so proud to know all of you. Um, I have respect for every single member of this body. And whether or not we agree politically or, philo or philosophically, I want you to know that you're important to me. And I hope that together we're going to do great things. So that's the acknowledgement of the big family here on the New Mexico State Senate, which I am very, very proud to be a part of with each and every one of you. And then my immediate family, I'm going to start with my youngest. This is, stand up, sweetie. This is my youngest, Stephen Taraco. He goes to public school, and he's in third grade. And he's a great student, and I'm so proud. And this is my son, um, James Taraco. And James is in fifth grade going to start middle school next year. He's also in public school. And then I have my daughter and her daughter, who um, last year at the session, my daughter Molly was pregnant. And now we have Charlotte, who's joining us, who's my first granddaughter. My daughter Mallory, who um, not only works full time, um, but she's also a full time student at the University of New Mexico. And she's a single mom. And I am so, so proud of her as well. And then my son, who's 21 years old, Andrew, couldn't make it today because his girlfriend gave birth two days ago. So I'm a grandma twice in six months, and that's um, baby Clark. So God bless. This <laughs> here is Charlotte. Every time everyone claps, she starts screaming. But so if every time there's a clap and there's clapping, and we all run out. That's why. But um, I just want to say God bless New Mexico. God bless the state of New Mexico, and God bless the New Mexico State Senate. Thank you so much. Senator Ortiz Pino, please. 